Let's talk about the weather. First, I want to highlight the fact that next week is going to be the warmest weather we've seen so far this year. Starting Mother's Day on Sunday, we're 93 degrees. We'll be in the mid 90s through the early and middle part of next week. May is often when we see 100s develop for the first time in the year. Not seeing it that hot just yet, but definitely in the mid 90s and this far out when you've got that kind of a warmth a signature or indication in the models uh, typically means, yeah, it's it's going to get toasty, maybe even pushing upper 90s by the middle and the end of next week. In the meantime, uh, it's actually chilly outside right now. We're in the 50s and breezy. We'll climb to the mid 70s this afternoon. Tomorrow remaining in the upper 70s in beige, peach, tan here. This is a wind advisory. It excludes Las Vegas. But it does include Southern Clark County, like Searchlight, and certainly Laughlin, uh, Boulder City technically in the mix, as is Lake Mead. Our winds, the steady wind speeds, around 15 miles per hour this morning in the Las Vegas Valley, but steady wind speeds between 20 and 30 miles per hour in that wind advisory area. And as we head through the afternoon, later today the breezes will relax closer to 10 miles per hour in Las Vegas, but we'll still have plenty of breezes uh, down the Colorado River Valley today and tomorrow in Las Vegas, some 30 mile per hour gusts, and they're going to be front loaded into the morning uh, each of the next couple of days. What's happening, a uh, broad area of low pressure is just going to keep things kind of cool the next few days, and there will be some pop up showers just north of us in Utah and other parts of Nevada. We don't have any shower chances, but there will be some partly cloudy conditions for the foreseeable future connected to that system. 70s today and tomorrow, 80s Friday, Saturday. But for my little lizard people over on the news desk who love the heat, good news, 90s start Sunday. We will take it, Justin. Thank you. We're looking forward to it. Yes, indeed. All right, the government's push to potentially ban TikTok in the U.S.